All that, still no clue where Hammer is. We're back to square one. Not exactly. The boss slipped us a pretty big hint. Oh yeah? When he was talking about Captain Hamura. Hmm? He might be in hiding, yeah. But the family looks to Hamura for guidance now. He's gotta be communicating with them somehow. If we can just listen in on one of their conversations... Are, are we sure that the, that the family just doesn't ask, to what would Hamura do? Like, ev for everything? Ears in there. Hmm, do I want an apple or an orange? I think what I would do. Hamura want? You want to bug their office. To cave in your skull! Hmm. So, that means I should use an apple then, because it doesn't squish as After easy. After everything that just went down, you know what sure. will happen if we get caught. <laughs> They'll kill us. Which means, we'll just have to enlist the help of an expert burglar. Aha. Uh -huh. You want to make Sugiura do it. I'll give him a ring. You go track down some bugs. Me? Make sure they're HD audio and shit. Meet me at the office once you've got them. That's because you're too cheap, Yagami. Ha ha ha. All right, well, let's uh, let's go see what Tsukumo's got for us. But also, it's the Kahina again. <laughs> Can we just ignore him, Yagami? Please. You think so? Hey, Off camera, just assume I threw Honda oh, into the, the Yakuza car again. What is it this sure. Time? I'm trying to keep this on the down low here, but I'm looking for bugs. Like, think you can help me bugs with or the other kind, <laughs> or... You know wait. who you're talking to, right? Of course I can. Thought so. You don't want to know what kind of bugs well, I'm looking for, uh... works for me, as long as I've got mm, the parts. It's usually not the kind you want to look for. I <laughs> won't find a safer pair of hands than literally my pair of hands. Plus, you get a friend discount. If you say so. Anyway, wow, you like, need? five, ten percent? Store and pick them up. <laughs> no need. Here's a riddle. You can get me from here, but I am not here. What am I? What? <laughs> Online shopping! Things get here in no time with rush shipping. I'll just need you to give me the cash. What cat. a terrible riddle. How much are we talking? <laughs> yeah, that, that kind of sucks. and labor? Let's say... A hundred thousand? That's with your friend discount? <laughs> yes, sir. I'm taking a loss on it for you, Yagamishi. <laughs> All right. Just let me know when you have the money, and I'll put the order in. You know, I gotta admit, I'm surprised that, like, there's not too many creases in the clothes he wears, considering what he does all day, every <laughs> that day. money burning Where? a hole in your pocket? Tsukumo? It's gonna yeah. run you a hundred grand for parts and labor. Yeah, I can, I, I, I can see where you're coming from on that. Here you go. <laughs> Thanks. It's gonna take a while, but I'll let you know when I'm done. Sounds good. All right, so now we just gotta go kill time. Oh. So, uh, this... I didn't do anything special, I just walked around town. It was about five minutes of real time. Oof. Hello? <laughs> the long-awaited time has come. Your order is ready. Dude, I can oh. smell you through my phone. You did that pretty fast, actually. I'll be waiting in the usual spot. But I just took a shower over at the, uh, the stall. I like how he says, like, I'll be hanging at the easier spot. Like, he would never leave. That That's oh, not true. We've seen him leave at least that once. That yeah, yeah, but, like, he's not going to leave for this. Minutes. This is true. <laughs> well, We're not a hot date. A Here you go. For him, at least. You don't know that. <laughs> They're designed to blend uh, this is true. power outlets, so just plug it in. Oh, and the signal range is 100 meters. It'll even go through metal plates or other obstacles, meaning you can listen from, say, the roof of a building? That's perfect. I think this is gonna work. You can turn them off remotely, too. So you don't have to listen constantly if you don't want to. I have and to say, CIA has it easy these days. Like you would have trouble finding <laughs> Back in the day, they had to get the minivan. I'm not sure that's entirely true, but thanks anyway. Deck it out with like Your life 40... That was dollars a year. You're very welcome. And then paint a convincing logo on the side to make sure no one thinks they're a, uh, it's a different van. Yeah. 
Never see those artists get credited. <laughs> Where's my United Artists? And uh, fishing group or whatever. Anyway, back to the office. Where you got a lot of materia. Hey, just stopping by for a bit. More like I got dragged here against my will. You get the bugs, Chuck? Sure did. Good. Take a seat. Before that, though, I just wanted to look at the job board. I was really hoping you were gonna like somehow sit on your pinball machine. I'm sure so you want to Yagami has tried that. Kaito-san told you, huh? Yep. Now explain what you told me, Sugiyura-kun. Well, uh, it's impossible. No way I can sneak in. They've literally got guys on watch, man. <laughs> oh my god, they have basic security. <laughs> Think about what would happen if I got caught. They'd beat me to death. Guess we're screwed. This isn't a joke, Kaito-san. Yeah. What are we gonna do? All right, all right, chill. I thought up something else. If Sugiura doesn't want to sneak in, we'll just find you a disguise. Huh? Just hear me out. You know this guy, Tak? <laughs> Who's that? Shintani. Guy's got a killer jacket. One of the Matsugane goons, yeah? Yep. Name's Tashiro-kun. The snazziest fucking Yakuza in town. Guy never takes his shades off, even at night. You know, his hide and build are awful close. To you, Yagami. You better not be thinking what I think you're thinking. That's exactly <laughs> what he mentioned at the start. Mask. Nobody'd know he was actually a different person. They wouldn't have a clue. Good idea. So what? You want me to dress up like Tashiroku and infiltrate the Matsugane office? Bingo. First things first. We gotta find him and grab his clothes and shades. The rest will be simple. Because you could never just there buy those yourself. Oh, and here I thought I was. Well, we gotta make sure he doesn't come back to the office. It's all in your capable hey, but you don't. Now. Like, you gotta say, Kaito. Theoretically, right. if you got into a fight with him, this through. or like didn't you know, knock him out in a very safe way, he'd break his glasses. Hmm. He falls in any way. Not now that I Glasses are boss. gone. Guess that sounds like no a challenge. Back, Might as well see this through to the end. Gotcha. Now let's go get Tashiro Kun's clothes. For some reason, the more I hear Kaito, the more I, I mean, think he's gonna he ask the auto boss to roll out. This dude really <laughs> never takes off his shades. I don't know if Crispin Freeman was ever in Transformers. Kaito-san. Hmm. So, do you, uh, have any idea where Tashiro-kun is? Let me think. Spirits Tashiro of the dead, you know. Cabaret. <laughs> be kind of goofy. Might be our best bet. <laughs> Which club? I think it was called Emerald Hill. <laughs> I start to <laughs> wonder, like, you know, maybe the Japanese are so superstitious nice for a reason. <laughs> All right, off to Emerald Hill Zone we go. Uh, oh, I thought you were playing as Kaito for a moment. Oh no, I'm sorry. Hey, oh, there's those ghosts again. Welcome, sirs. <laughs> Table for two? Actually, we want to ask you a question. I don't know why it this took me until this long to, joint, yeah? to uh, think that this might yes, be a Sonic sir. 2 joke. Why do you ask? We're looking for somebody. You know a guy named Tashiro? I miss Tashiro? Flashy Emerald jacket. Hills? Always Emerald Hills Zone? Uh, you gotta it. know the guy. Ow. <laughs> it's the name of the club. Him. There you go. I yeah. knew you know him. Any idea where he is? <laughs> Actually, he was in the club. Maybe this guy was like more in blue or something, or some spiky hair. Though. So he saw them out. Maybe. Personally, I'm we don't even have to look for anyone like golden drinks. brown or Would golden blonde because that—that's already Tashiro. Probably toward yeah. He said there's a back alley. Nobody ever goes in there. Smart. If you're gonna beat the crap out of someone, better to do it where nobody's gonna find you. Sometimes I think you kind of miss doing that shit. Anyway, let's get moving. Right. Before I beat Thanks the so. shit out of somebody. Oh, of course. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, we got to go find the back alley at uh, Tenkaichi Street. Those ex yakuza yeah. always thinking they're superior to people. It's uh, this one here behind that bar, Serena. 
Anyway, there he is. Listen, you old fuck. Didn't you see the sign? You can look, but not touch. <laughs> Please, I never touched anyone. Huh? Bullshit, you didn't. The girls know all about your pervy ass. There he is. Toshiro Kuhn. You, uh... Weren't kidding about how Fun fact, Toshiro is voiced by Most Pro ZD. Impressed. Huh? Wait, you're Yagami. Oh, congrats. You He's a the guy your whole voice actor after. who's Shut very memeable on the internet. Um, uh, I'm just gonna... Hey, get the hell back here. Damn it. He got away because of you. Oh, is guess. he the guy who did... He, he does like this... Um, you see, do you think like the videos? Got the feel, even if your girl I, I think so. Huh? The fuck you, you, you know? You've probably seen his stuff, even if you don't Sounds know like him you were right on the by line. name. Yeah. Of course. That's how shit goes around here. It's only fair that we take his clothes, yeah? He did, like, that short video on Bowsette. you talking about? Yeah, yeah, that was him. We'll yeah, 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 okay, yeah. <laughs> Won't be long. Promise. Internet got all fucky with Bowser. <laughs> you got any idea That's how funny. much these threats cost? <laughs> Not a what. But you know how dangerous Kamurocho is. Should have expected somebody want to jump you. We won't have to hurt you if you just hand them over. Everything will stay nice and clean, too. It's a win-win. So, are you stripping or not? What kind of question is that, pretty boy? If you want my clothes, you're gonna have to rip them off! I, for one, am glad that episode 69 is the one where we force a guy to take his clothes off. Anyway, let's Great get the shit out of Tashiro. Right <laughs> made, made me really feel like you guys are putties versus the Power Rangers. <laughs> Specifically the yellow Power Ranger. Oh, he does kind of look like he'd be, he could be a Power Ranger, huh? <laughs> Make it so we transform! <laughs> I love how there's an audience, even though this is supposed to be an alleyway that no one goes to. Of course, it's just one of those things in Kamurocho. On your way to work, ah, maybe you just saw you see a fight. Whatever. Oh, I can go for a uh, for some dinner theater right now. I was really hoping that you were gonna kick that sign into him to like kill him, but I probably could have tried to do that actually. He, he got you instead. Okay, let's just get this over with, talk. Yep, don't want anyone walking in on this. That's why we're not gonna block any of the entrances. This guy's fucking loaded. His wallet's burst into the goddamn seams. Don't take his money. We're not thieves. Yeah, yeah, I know. Wait, don't clothes count as stealing? Like I said, we're just we'll just borrow yeah. for a bit. If you say so, you're the lawyer. Man, really man, glad that you're just like I was exposing him. You look Good talk. You know, you're just like, oh yeah, hey Yagami, let's use better, our real names. You better get to the Matsugane. <laughs> Cops <laughs> won't know anything. Speaking of, Kaito-san, think you can take care of him? Huh? What do you mean? We can't leave the guy naked outside this time of year. <laughs> Always a big softy. Sure, I'll handle him. Can't go with you anyway, not looking like regular old Kaito. Thanks. Talk. Don't mess this up. I won't. A lot of faith. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> what in the absolute fuck is this? <laughs> oh, spare me. They're not my clothes. <laughs> okay. Okay, I'm okay. See you out front of the Matsugane office. All right. I'll be right over. Can we say pretty fly for a rice guy? Or yeah, that... you know what? I'll allow it. <laughs> I feel like somehow that's really culturally insensitive. It probably is, but you know what? I'll allow it. <laughs> Sorry for the wait, Sugira. <sighs> hey, Sugira? 
Sorry, I think you have the wrong guy. <laughs> God, I just can't help it. I, for one, am glad this. that this guy who's masking himself <laughs> as a man? prominent the Yakuza, ever the flashiest, that's for sure, Maybe is just wanna try planting these totally instead? okay with using everybody's sorry, normal sorry. name. It's, it's perfect, honest. Yeah, everyone knows yeah, who whatever. you are around these parts, I guess. Over with now. Yakuza, and it makes you wonder you why you haven't disguised in the first place. Right you set <laughs> just come why not just go as Bram Stroke and Stoker's Dracula? So, you ready? Well, we just need to get in the door. Yeah, Bram Sylvania, just be like, oh, I'm scouting this. Yeah. Good to go. This building for one of my more recent shoots. <laughs> it's really not that funny. I think that might draw too much attention, though, because everybody's going to want to be a big star like Bram Sylvania. Yeah, which is why you have somebody as like your agent, quote unquote, come in behind. Hmm. Oh, sorry. I have to go to the bathroom. And Bram Sylvania goes, oh. would you mind letting my esteemed, esteemed colleague use your your facilities? Me and you, we got to hit the club sometime. Yeah, maybe when I'm not so busy with work. Though, so if the uh, the message that, that popped up a while ago didn't pull you, uh, tip you off, uh, we do get to keep Tashiro's clothes as a disguise. Of course. Hey, Tashiro. All clear at Emerald Hills? Glad you can take care of yourself. We got enough to worry about looking for Yagami. I almost would have enjoyed it. Mind keeping an eye on the uh, office for me? Yagami, either Yagami yeah, pretending to be Pro ZD or Pro ZD doing a bad five. impression of himself. Oh, that would have been great. I know it would have been great. I thought of it. <laughs> Hire me. Hire me. <laughs> Alright, so now we gotta find some power outlets to plug these wiretaps into. Suspicious. That, uh, that seems a little unsafe. What are you talking about? Look, I'm just saying, it just takes one person to trip over a loose wire, and then everyone's phones fall over. A along with the thing that, that they're dangling around. That's why oh. it's on the edge. Like, you're not gonna pass your feet there. Anyway, the cat's right there out of the window. Of course. Oh my god, you're killing the Feng Shui, buddy. We'll move it back eventually. I don't believe you. Maybe. I don't know if I believe me either. I like how you can complete this, but hey, you still need to look for that extra slot there, buddy. What the? Those bastards. I bought that 40 years ago. Dude, old coffee makers are, like, indestructible. I don't know what it yeah, is wh about them. Why replace a perfectly good coffee maker? Hmm. Suspicious. You know, those things are way more visible than I thought they'd be. Right? I thought they were supposed to blend in with the outlet. Yeah. They like, just kind of jut out. I really felt like they looked like, the, you know those plastic inserts to that kids? Oh. I thought they'd look like that. No, it's just like a little yeah. wall wart. Yeah, it's more like um, uh, like a Wi-Fi extender or something. Yeah, yeah. I I always have trouble finding this last one. Incidentally, I like how even Yagami's cutting you. For Suspicious. Looking over the same locations. I can't believe you'd do that to Matsugane himself. And then I can't believe you forgot where the outlet was when you looked right at it the first time. <laughs> no, actually, this is just me looking around to see if there's anything to inspect. Oh, okay, good. What the? But, se but seriously, Yagami, who raised you to hey. do this? What the? Huh? Huh? You can do it. No, Yagami, don't rearrange. <laughs> what is this TV plugged into? It's not. Hey, it's Yaga. It's one of those cordless, like, you know the, um, the photo Honestly, display units there? Hurry up and get your ass down. Ah. They just, like, you just load it up with a USB or whatever. And just, just 
just a rolling uh, album of all your favorite uh, photos. I see, I see. Mm-hmm. Very hip thing for lots of guys, really. What the hell are you doing, you? Tashiro? You know no going in the boss's room without permission. If anything happened, it'd be on me. Hey, I was not there when I ended the uh, investigation. Yeah. yeah, it's kind of a cheap thing. What are you ignoring me for? A little bit. Say something, damn it! Then he goes right for the what face, the like. Yagami! That's a great friend. Uh, guess I'm busted, huh? You got balls climbing into the lion's mouth knowing you're just gonna get eaten. Wow, these guys have a friggin' amazing response time. Right? I'm really glad Where that- Where were these guys? I'm really glad that Yagami also didn't, like, immediately just headbutt the dude when he tried to, like, swipe at you. <laughs> well, I mean, at least all this destruction is gonna conceal the stuff you put in the plugs. It's true. They won't know what's horrible and what's broken. Oh, I don't remember if I turned the camera to go look at the, the phone wall. Uh, they're probably still there. You can't prove they're not, so frankly... I think I saw them. For just a second. Nope. Uh, I can't believe you break such an awesome looking dish. That was just the trash stuff in the office. That's rude. <laughs> Come on, Yagami, have some respect. No, Matsugane's TV! <laughs> I just want this thing. I can't believe you broke the air conditioner. <laughs> On top of everything else. <laughs> You're not getting away that easy. Say your prayers, shithead! It's okay, everything's fixed. Remember, what you're supposed to do when fighting someone with a firearm is give... is gain distance between you and the shooter. What the? That'll work. Now, you know why that guy couldn't figure out where Yagami was? Uh... Lay it on me. That was a close one. It's because sound. when shooting a firearm indoors, yep. the sound is amplified. Heard everything thanks to the bugs. Oh, so he was just at the last he was probably suffering some major tinnitus. Thanks well, no, you Save wouldn't suffer life. tinnitus because it's more of the long-term we'll effects. Long what you would suffer from yeah. uh, not protecting your ears. Well, yeah. He, he just straight up he couldn't hear. Then is what you're saying. Exactly. Mm -hmm.